Happy vapors, come lend me your ears, for today we have a spooky treat. I'm not scared. I feel like I haven't worn these goggles in forever. Yeah, we got some juice in by Bad Drip Labs. You know, they made all those like weird acid trip looking juices in the prescription bottles. They got some pretty cool marketing, that's for sure. So anyways, this is one of their lines right here. Director's Cut. It's like a horror themed e-liquid. I like horror movies. You think I didn't know, huh? Who are you? I didn't used to like horror movies when I was a little kid. My brother made me watch Nightmare on Elm Street and held my eyes open and then I had nightmares forever. Every time I went to bed, I was like, one, two. Daddy's coming for you. This stuff is called The Devil Inside and it's supposed to be watermelon, mixed plucked berries, and green apple splatters. Sounds pretty good, right? So yeah, it's a fruit blend. We haven't had too many fruit flavors as of late, or just straight fruit flavors. We've been having a lot of dessert flavors and stuff like that. So this should be a nice change of pace. And here it is in all of its shiny glory. It comes with this plastic wrap crap on it. And I'm gonna take that stuff off because it's annoying. And it's quite glaring, if you will. A unique looking bottle here. It is glass. And it's a pretty cool shape. It's just a little cylinder and it's got some pretty sick artwork on it there's your milligram up here we're vaping on a three today comes in zero three and six milligrams but look at this artwork so this stuff's called the devil inside so there must be a devil inside this chick maybe it's rosemary's baby maybe it's poltergeist she's gonna throw up some some vomit or something yeah maybe that's what it is maybe it's poltergeist because as we get over here, we see some crosses that are upside down. And look at this. Blow, director's cut. It looks like a scary movie poster over here. Pretty sweet. Rated R, because things are about to get weird. And rated R. And then down here at the bottom it says, Evil never tasted so good. Oh yeah. Oh crazy, I didn't even notice that. The bottom of the little clapper thing is a butcher knife. Look at that. If this juice don't taste good, I'm gonna be upset because this artwork is dope. But anyways, let's give it a shake. Let's get down to the whiff test. Let's see what a whiff lag. Woo! It is strong smelling. I smell like a candy type of watermelon. I also smell a little bit of like maybe some blackberries, maybe blueberries, and definitely some green apple. I can smell the sourness of the green apple. The strongest, I think, is the green apple and the watermelon. The berries are kind of... Mm, so, let's see how that comes out when it vapes. Might come out a little bit different, but for right now, the smell is straight green apple splatters. For our vaporizer machine and RDA, we're going to be using the double barrel mod with the capstone RDA on top. So let's get into the gratuitous drip shot. This is the standard Fuse Clapton set in here. I've been rocking these for a few weeks. I haven't wanted to part ways with them yet. And they're from the Coilology kit. And of course I got that Native Wix Platinum Blend on there. Boom. Boom. Got enough juice flowing there. I'll give it a poof. 75 watts 0.19 ohm coil or actually it's reading at 0.18 now oh look at the steam yeah green apple and watermelon for sure let's throw this cap on here and let's get to vaping i'm gonna drip a little bit more in here and then i'm gonna vape this stuff here we go Mm. <coughs> Ooh, got a little bit of a throat hit. I would say this is a pretty severe three milligram throat hit. That's a, whew. yeah, definitely a tickle on the throat hairs. I drip a little bit more here. Huh, okay. So I definitely get watermelon. Hmm, hold on. <coughs> My throat is on fire. Any cold drink of ice water. <coughs> Woo! <laughs> that 
That is a throat punch and a half. Let's see if I can get through this so I can actually taste what's going on in here. Definitely getting a green apple at first and then I'm getting like maybe a berry flavor. I don't know if it's, it's kind of like a black or a blueberry. Like I was saying earlier, I don't know about mixed berries. Maybe there's some raspberry in there and it's just a little bit. I don't know. Not really getting a, a bunch of the berries, but on the end is straight watermelon. But it's like a, it's almost like a candy watermelon. Yeah, that stuff is good. Sweetness level. It's a little bit sweet, but it's not too sweet. Maybe old Mike Macaroni can come over here and try this stuff out. Go Knights, go. Definitely get watermelon and apple. I wasn't really listening to what you were saying, but I guess that's good. It does have a bit of a throat hit. Like a kangaroo's punching you right in the throat muscle. That actually a hell of a throat hit. <coughs> That's kind of making it more difficult to taste the flavor. Watermelon and tart apple, killer throat hit, and uh, sweetness level, it's not that sweet. I don't think it's that sweet. I think it's like, I don't know, 5 out of 10 sweet. That's pretty good though. Just a throat hit. I don't really vape fruit flavors, straight fruit flavors. I usually stick to dessert flavors. That's just my stilo. Don't forget my spring sprinkle. That's just my style. But this stuff is pretty good. I'm interested to try the other flavors. The artwork is... Whoever did this artwork, you did a great job, fella. Or madam. But yeah, there's like a bunch of other flavors in this line. I think they have one dessert flavor, but it's not really a dessert. It's more of a breakfast flavor. All the other ones are fruit flavors or fruit candies. Pretty good stuff, devil inside. All day vape status? I would say so. But yeah, we got this stuff on the Vape Happy website. Thank you for being a friend. Subscribe over here. Buy the juice down here, Vape Malone. I'm a lyricologist.